Hello everyone, I'm back again. Let's take a look at these two questions. Now, this setup that you have seen over here is a very familiar setup. All my pupils in my tuition center will know because they have done the experiment in class. So now, we're going to try to explain this in words, okay? How to explain this in words? Here comes the question, okay? What happens? when the marbles are dropped into the measuring cylinder. Part, question two, explain why. Now, I always tell my pupil, when you see this word, happens, it's always based on what you see, okay? What you see or what you observe. So do not tell me what you imagine, but tell me what you really see them. So science is always very, very specific on words. Now, one of the words that I have taught before is this word, water level. I have taught this word many times, water level. Do not use the volume of water, don't talk about any of this, always talk about the water level. The water level increases. That would be the answer for the question because the question asks you what happens when the marbles are dropped in the measuring cylinder. So only the water level increases. Now, in the past I will still see people saying the volume of the water increases. It will be marked wrong. Why volume of water increases is wrong. Think about this. They are adding water? No. Did I remove some water? No. If you did not change the volume of water, meaning you did not remove or you did not add in, you cannot say the volume of water increases. All you can tell me is the water level increases. Have you taken note of that? Okay, now let's talk about uh, question two. This time now they want us to explain. Now, teacher Patrick has taught this magical phrase before. I think. Um, Pupils who are not with me at the learning center can also learn this to answer your science questions. It's really, really effective. Now, what is that phrase? It's this, uh, blank takes the space of blank. I came up with this myself after looking through so many practice papers. You know, what is the similarity? What's the trend in the question? The phrasing is that simple. They ask you to explain, explain what? Explain why the water level increases. Now, the water level increases because of the marbles, you'll tell me. Now, remember, in this diagram, what are the two items that you see inside the measuring cylinder? You'll tell me, yes, teacher, I know these are marbles and water. Now, use these two words, fill into these two blanks. Tell me what is the proper sequence. Do you think I should put it as Water take the space of marbles or marbles take the space of water. You decide. I'll give you a few seconds. Aha, uh -huh. okay. So, definitely it's marbles take the space of water. So, the water level increases. Have you gotten it? I think I will cut this video up into three parts. I'll show you the next video. I'll show you the question in the next video, okay? Alright, see you in a while.